Tyco number 930 unloading box car introduced in 1971 and last cataloged in 1980. This electric operating set consists of a 40 foot box car specially modified with an operating hatch on the roof to load crates that drop to a chute to figure that kicks them out. This is the set out of the box assembled. The box car is Chinese red for the CB and Q Burlington route and this was the only car that came in this series no other ones were done the car operates by the two prongs you see here sticking out on the side of the car which is where it picks up the electric current from those brass contact plates on the unloading base this is the unloading base the contact strips you see there are brass the car enters this section of track and you stop the prongs on those contacts when this button is pushed the power is supplied to the brass contacts which touch the prongs on the car activating the man inside to kick the barrels out or crates. I am using the classic 899B Tyco power pack connected to the AC side as you see here. The following demonstration will show the prongs contacting the brass plate and you'll notice they'll slide in. This is how the car gets its power to operate again. To load the barrels in the box car, you raise this flap here and get your barrels or crates and just insert them down in there like that and they'll slide in. Here's a side view of how it happens when you drop the crate in the top. It comes down to chute and rest right there for the man to kick out. And now the operation, the buzzing noise you hear is the power pack, which is normal for these older power packs. And here goes the kick out. If you have a set and it's not operating properly, take a piece of 800 emery cloth and clean your contact strips here, upper and lower. Also clean your prong points right here by taking the emery cloth and going around it. Make sure there's no rust on it as this will impair the operation of the solenoid in the car. After doing those two things, it should work. If it does not, check your switch. And if you have to, you can make a new one by going to Radio Shack and get you a contact switch, which operates the same as a Tyco. The type of switch would be normally open, so when you close it, the current goes through, and when you release, the current stops. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.